feel like Tommy's gonna like hit us up and be like, you know what? Can you please take it down? Please. Yeah. It's a little bit too much going on. We're having like get together with friends, right? So I, I feel like all this is so fast. <laughs> Oh hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Look, I'm not alone today. I'm with my little Leo. Not Leo sign. This is Miriam. Hi guys. So my name is Miriam and we are friends. So I'm an Instagrammer and I have decided to create my very own the YouTube channel. So please go ahead and do subscribe. We're gonna film tons of really cool videos and really really nice content from the fashion to makeup tutorials and what to wear, where to go in Los Angeles, how to be, how to be. Too. True, that's true. Yeah. A little exercises yes. if you're down for that. And today cool. we have an amazing, super fun challenge. We spent how much did we spend together? It's like oh really God. embarrassing to say. <laughs> yes, um, we spent more than two grand. I think yeah, all okay. together. That's true. Yeah. On the new Tommy Hilfiger line yeah. with Zendaya. Yeah. Uh, what do you think about the whole collection? I very interesting. It's like 60s inspired boho. It's so not training, Tommy. Which is not, yeah, exactly. It's not. It's mm -hmm. not. But I like how she kind of brought this vibe of all women of all generations and all skin types. Yeah, I just feel it's really fresh. It's interesting. I feel it's kind of overpriced for Tommy. Yeah, that was like way too much. Actually, yeah. we can't get all that many items for two grand. Yeah, yeah. like a few. This is, this is much. It's not too much. It's like no, super it's light. Like, yeah. Can I already open? Continue. <laughs> <laughs> no. so it's not like really big. Like I can lift it like pretty easily. Yeah, maybe because we work out. Maybe. By now, my feelings is that it's a little too overpriced. Not that I yes. was like spectacular blown away by any items. We're two totally uh, different body yes. types. Which I think is also super interesting. I look super pale, right? This is ridiculous. She's I literally not. look white. Yeah. I look like I'm from Twilight. I look like Edward. I love that movie. Who was your favorite? I love Bella. Really? Not like, no, actually, I mean, I like her when she became a vampire. Just go do, do like this with me. Oh, nice. That was, that was good for the first time. Let's <laughs> have one more time. Okay, so first of all, the boxing wasn't wasn't pretty at all. It was just like a giant cardboard. Here. <laughs> what like is that? Whole, yeah. <gasps> How much did it be for that? Okay, so 165 plus tax, like 185. Oh, fine. I feel this is gonna be like one of the best items from the entire thing. <laughs> oh my, my god, sir, this looks so cheap. What? This looks like a little sticker. Look at this, this is ridiculous. Bigger feel with my shoes because they just won't fit me. Like, I'm size 38 European and this is as, as far as I could get in them. Got, yeah, I've got clocks as well. So basically, those are the ones that I've got. You know, on the photo, they were super fun. And I think, actually, they're light for clocks, which is good. They're pretty. I mean, as much as clocks can be pretty. Is it just that yours have the same, like, ridiculousness going on around it? So if you see, the clocks are kind of, they're uneven, pretty much. They're cute. Yeah. I want to try them on, but honestly, so far, I'm kind of disappointed. Ooh. Yeah, this is my fun. What is that? Is that a dress? Yeah. yeah. I see what you're doing here. Yep, there you go. I... Yeah. I don't know, what do you think about the material? Well, I don't think it's too... It feels... It doesn't feel any kind of like luxurious or something. Yeah. It's kind of rough on your skin. Yeah. It feels like a little soldier attire. Yeah. Curve. Almost feel it should be kind of a little itchy. Like when you wear like wool, like your skin feels weird. Feels a little big for me. I'm also not really buying this Bermudian triangle over here. I don't know what we're trying to find between my boobs. To be honest, like, why would this be a thing? I've got. Ta! So I've got a dress. I haven't even seen this one up online, actually. They had in two sizes. They had for curvy people and they had regular. Oh, is this for curvy? Is no, this curvy? is regular. Oh, this is the curvy I like. I don't know if this is a yeah. okay. Just... No, I really love all body types. I love I body types who work on themselves, right? As long as you're healthy yeah. and happy and like feel comfortable in your own body, then I feel it's good. Eh. it would look really flattering like from my perspective because so far what I don't like about this is that it's synthetic because they say it's satin but trust me I know it definitely feels Wait, like it's, it's, it's like satin it's well, synthetic. Guess, well, it feels like something that you would be able to buy at like forever 21 
I don't think it fits well woman with curves a little bit too much going on <laughs> like I don't know if I would be probably in Miami I might have pulled something like that I'm so that looks cute okay this is just a t-shirt that I got when they had this whole collection of different astrological signs and you know what it reminds me of it reminds me of like a baby <laughs> Right? I don't know. Well, this one actually was the cheapest one out of what we got. It's 60 bucks plus tax. I just got this amazing vintage looking t shirt for like 14. The material is so nice. Okay. But really, you know that like nice vintage tee, how that feels. And this one like really reminds me of like baby clothes. Not too bad. Hello. Hello. Hi. No, I'm just checking that yeah, we're the, not yeah. super exposed. I was looking at this material. I it was like the Sony. Needed. <laughs> I think it looks cute. It's a sweater, so it's pretty much, you know, I can use it. I mean, would I ever wear it? How much is it? Yeah, it's 150 plus tax. <sighs> That's all I can say, seriously. Yeah, for 150, it's like, it's like, it's just so disappointing. This is a very sad, like, <laughs> this is you like know, a very sad haul. What's going on with Tommy Hilfiger? I, do I think it's cute? It is cute. Do I think I can wear this? I can wear this. Do I think it's worth $150 plus tax? I don't. I think you can buy a lot of similar stuff, even in like Gap, I would say. Or oh my god, yes. Right? 21, Topshop, I don't like know. Anywhere, Zara. Any, I feel like, like Zara would even have a better quality than this, to be honest. Another thing is quality. I'm like, I'm really not impressed. Yeah. Like, okay, so far, looking wise, this is my favorite from what I've seen. Yeah. So far, I'm very sad and disappointed at home. Yes. <laughs> okay, so next thing that I got, I feel like it was pretty. Oh God! Oh what my is God! That? This is so bad. <laughs> I'm so sorry. This is just bad. Okay, so what they had? They had a few lingerie-ish. Oh, it's a lingerie. Items. So I got this one to see how this one is gonna feel. It's a high-waisted. Is it lingerie or is it swimwear? It feels like in the middle of swimwear lingerie. Uh, Swim, swimwear-ish. Clean in a net bag machine wash. I mean, I think it's I'm underwear. You really? It feels so synthetic. Also, I don't even know. Like, I mean, once this is, I mean, can you even see how transparent once this is? is this? Wet? Like, once this is wet, everything will be showing. Let me tell you. <laughs> can you see it through? No, I don't think. It's I don't think. Through. But we can see through it. So the quality is like I would not wear it on a daily basis. I would be like, I don't know what my skin is exposed to, oh. honestly. It has a like, very synthetic feel. I thought that would be a lingerie, but then I felt it and I'm like, okay, this is swimwear. But now I'm just confused. How much was it? Altogether, it's $30 plus 40. 40. It was like a 100 for this. 30 plus 40. Yeah, it's not enough. Their swim, like first thing that I'm gonna say. Yeah, this does feel like a swimsuit. It does. It's a Brazilian high-waisted bottom. I wanna call it. It looks nice. It feels nice. It has a little logo. logo in here, which I don't know how I feel about that. Honestly, I feel this is gonna be all cracked. Thing. Yeah, you know that that material. Once you like pull it a little bit, it's just gonna be all cracked. Sure. Me. And top. So the top one is, first of all, it's really basic swimwear. Really okay? basic, Re not, there's nothing no, crazy no, about no, it. No, 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 It doesn't have any details besides that fancy logo thing. So, so closure is actually really decent in the back. And the price would be, the bottom was 45 and the top was 60. 100, 100 plus tax, yeah. It feels nice though. It just feels like it feels swimwear. Good. You know what, I just feel like you miss feeling something that feels normal after Probably. everything that we felt this is so true. far. That's true. We're like, this is so bad, this is so bad. Oh, this is, feels normal, so it's so good. Yeah, yeah like that's what's I happening agree. I agree. psychologically. I agree, I agree. $100 is not bad. Do I think you can go and find some stuff like a bikini for a hundred bucks that's probably cuter? Sure, but it's not bad. So in case you feel attached to this collection with Zendaya, you love blue color. It's like dirty blue, it's not even like it's, navy blue. It's not blue. a navy blue. So in case dirty. all of that is the case, you can get them. It feels good, like, but it's a regular bikini, not a hundred dollars. 
for the bikini. I have my last item. How many items do you have left? Two. Two? Oh, that's great. Okay, this is something that I'm most hopeful about. You know, I should say that. I really love the packaging here. Yeah, just a paper, not the whole packaging. Just no, paper. no, no. Paper yeah, is cool. Paper's cool. It's pretty. It's etro mixed with Gucci. Oh, hippie. that is so true. Those look not bad. Uh... uh <laughs> Okay, okay, here are the boots. The boots have arrived. Um, Can you see the bottom? Yeah. So, you know how in like in expensive shoes, like bottom would be leather and like almost sweaty leather fill? Yeah. Well, this one is definitely not. Well, you know what, let me tell you, I have a couple of shoe pairs from like Lola Shooting for like 30 bucks and <laughs> much more expensive than these. These feel like I got them at a Chinese so store also nearby. So, also look at this, it like already has a damage here. How much were they? $300. No. 330 with tax. I this really is wanna... way too much for this book. So, Maybe. it already came with a damage here, right here, with a damage right here. This is ridiculous, this, this little top, yeah. Yeah, how the heel top. I don't even know. It looks so cheap. The whole thing, like leather is always decreased in here, like why? They look like Zara shoes. Okay. They look more than Zara shoes. I just got a new pair of Zara sandals and they are like really good quality. Zara has stepped up their game, Topshop has stepped up their game, and Tommy Hilfiger has stepped downgraded down. their game. Yeah, yeah stepped step down. down. So what do you think? You know, I think I love it. <laughs> I'm, feeling, I'm feeling the, the almost on boot style trend. This is a vibe. I'm actually really excited because I was really hopeful for Me those too. Because on the photos, they really look mm -hmm. good. And I thought for $300, you would get something a little better than that. I have two more items. Do you have like one or two? I don't have any. Oh, you don't? You don't? I'm just left with a uh, disappointment over here. So <laughs> I have this cup. First of all, I want to talk about this because I've tried this on already. Let's talk about this. Let's talk let's, about this. Let's have okay. a little chat. This one actually throws me off a lot because, okay, I am curvy. I feel like this is a message I need to bring to people because I think a lot of people can relate to it. First of all, I'm curvy. I have I have a thinner waist and I have a big butt. I work out to keep myself in shape, but I'm a bigger person. So they mark this top as a size six. Dash, ready? EU36. That's an incorrect transcription. It's not. So this top is really small. This like is size two. And it's right because size 36 is the size 2. Now I look at this and it throws me off because it's size 6, it should fit me. Then how would I feel that like something size 6 does not fit me, you know? I feel fat. Like yeah. what, should, should like buy size 10 just because this doesn't fit me? I feel it's really, really no, wrong. No, it's really wrong. Yeah, I don't like that. So far, this kind of really throws me off, like the sizing of it. Best case scenario, I would have exchanged this because it looks really cute. I think it's really trendy right now. Uh -huh. But honestly, it costs $200, so it's 220 with tax. And I'm already kind of disappointed because of sizing. I yeah. wouldn't get that. You wouldn't go, no. go for no. change. No. Oh, this is probably my favorite item in the collection. It's a white like flare jeans. They were $149. Okay, it's kind of like G brand. I feel like 150 bucks for perfectly fitted jeans, yeah, so which are high quality, is okay. Yeah, that's true. I, I'm totally on the same page for that. So, yeah. nothing bad to say about them. I wish they would have an option where you can buy your the correct length, because I'm tall, I'm like 5'11". Okay. Jeans buying is kind of always an issue for me, because everything is short. You yeah, automatically like, become hipster. I wish there would be an option to purchase something longer, yeah. but we'll see, maybe this fits great, and then I don't know what shorter women do. So, okay. I think this is the time for our final yeah. review. So what are, what are your final thoughts on it? I am returning all of it. Yes, I am very disappointed. I think it's poor quality, it's overpriced, and the sizing is off. Seriously. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm returning everything as well. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for staying with us anyway. We wanted to be as truthful as possible with you because I think this I hope you guys enjoyed that. Because we're a little rude, but it's okay. I feel like this is why you're watching yeah. the videos to actually know the truth about this or that collection. Let us know down below if you want to see more videos like that. Subscribe to Miriam's channel. Subscribe to our Instagrams, like just links flying all yeah, over the thing. Over. And I'll see you next week or maybe we'll see you next week. Bye you guys, thank you so much for staying. We love you. Bye.